Hey beautiful people, I hope you are keeping safe and well. Welcome to my YouTube channel. For those who I haven't met before, I'm Emma Ryder, Psychic Medium and Divine Channeler, and this is the Daily Twin Flame Reading. Please bear in mind that as a rule, I tend to read where the Divine Masculine is at and the messages coming through from the Divine Masculine. In no way, shape or form am I saying that this journey is one-sided, as I 100% know it isn't. I also know I have a lot of Divine Masculines watching, so please do switch DM to DF if that resonates with your journey. Trust your heart. Okay, so because there is so much mirroring and I feel the mirroring is being more, is more prominent at the moment for the twin flames I'm going to be using the mirror truth Lern, Len, oh god I can't say that word Lenormand cards however you say it anyway you know what I mean so let's have a look and see what today's message is and for those of that of you that need to know I want to say to you that there is a lot of spiritual support and guidance around for you at the moment and also your divine masculine there is they're playing with my hair and tickling my ears it feels very much you need to know you're not on your own okay because you're not you are supported 100 percent. always allow yourself to be supported okay i actually feel like i've got the weight of the world on my shoulders divine masculine so I feel they, there is some strange energies going on this week. I feel like they're weighing quite heavy on the Divine Masculine today. And... I want to say they're like trying to shake them off, but they're struggling to get momentum. But they are working on releasing some of that stuff that is holding them back. Okay, and the first card out is a rider. They are moving forwards. They're trying to free themselves. The horse always um, makes me feel like freedom and running free and moving towards where they want to be because a horse will never run towards where they don't want to be. They will f flee from it, okay? And I really feel this card is significant that the Divine Masculine is fighting and moving towards where they want to be, which is you, okay? Um, it feels like... I know they've got the rider on this horse as well, so I do feel like that is you two both moving in the same direction as well because you both want the same things. And you're in harmony together. You are communicating together telepathically. And anybody that deals with horses knows that horses are very sensitive telepathic beings. And if you're in a bad mood, they will pick up that straight away. For example, I one of my horses that I've had for nearly 20 years, he will bite me if I'm in a bad mood or need to sort myself out. So they are very in tune they are more, more aware than some people allow them or believe. Some people believe. But there's definitely that movement forwards together here and being very in tune, very aligned together. Moving towards your me where you're meant to be. Moving towards your Lady Divine Masculine. You're moving towards each other. And I feel the green in those two cards is very significant as well because I feel like there's so much healing, so much um, healing and support there between you. Any little triggers, any little challenges that are coming up are being healed and this moving together is healing in itself. Know that the angels are definitely listening. Are you listening to your angels because they are tickling my ears? Then we've got the clouds card, okay? And that really is like two harps coming together. It's like winter and summer coming together. The divine masculine, the divine feminine coming together. Clouds makes me feel like it's heaven-like. You are coming together there. I feel like the coming together is heaven-like, okay? 
and also the blue and the green if you mix colours, this is really quite a random thought, also creates green. Blue and yellow makes green. There's the merging. You're merging together. That's beautiful. Okay, then we have the anchor card. Okay, because I want to say it's safe to merge together. It is safe to come together. It is safe to be in this energy of moving together. And we have the crossroads card. Okay. And I don't feel like that is a crossroads as in got to make a decision. I actually feel this is the crossroads where you're merging together. And then you are heading up this path together. We've got more green here, actually. Um, and the tree feels like the tree of life. The tree, because you are growing together, you've been planting these seeds and working along this path and you are growing together now as you merge together. There's definitely a lot of merging going on. Then we've got the scythe card. Okay. And the scythe card is actually the number 10 card as well, which is always a completion number. But I feel the scythe is like letting go of that old way of being as you merge together. Because you are, as, you're, as it's healing in itself for those last little things, you're letting go of that last little bit, which is beautiful and more green in the scythe card. Then we've got the tree card because there's, and more greenery. These cards aren't all green, it just seems to be a theme. It feels important, the healing which is happening today. And also if you look at the tree, there is the infinity symbol on there as well. Um, and the butterfly for transformation. As you merge together, there is that transformation. It is going to be forever. And you are growing together. You have been going through separate spiritual growths. You have been growing as people. And as you come together, you merge together, there's even more growth and transformation to happen. And then we've got the Stokes card, which is that new beginning. But look at the family. You are together as a family. And there's more greenery. <laughs> The greenery is definitely a theme. There's definitely a lot of healing. There's, it's that merging together. You are merging together in union and you are growing together, which is beautiful. You're in harmony, you're in tune with each other. It's amazing. the universe card is I find a deeper meaning and personal growth amid discomfort you've had to go through the discomfort to get to this point and now you can grow together as you go through that transformation thank you so very much for joining me please do like and comment on the video if you feel drawn if you haven't already please hit that subscribe button I truly do appreciate each and every single person supporting the channel Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I also want to thank everybody that sends gifts from Amazon um, and those of you that have my address, to be fair. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm truly grateful. I do try and thank everybody, but just in case I miss anybody, thank you. I am so grateful for each and every single person supporting the channel in views, supporting me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Please do take care, stay safe, and I so look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Namaste.